whose hair is going to get caught in the drain while you're gone? Look at all this stuff. All right, so I want to do a quick video. Um, we're taking the dead halt from our regularly scheduled programming. Uh, I think the last video I did was the 56, which isn't even here anymore because it's sold. Um, I have done a little bit of work in the wagon. Look at the garage. Look at the chaos. Oh. Are you, you're not leaving it like this, are you? Holy moly, I have not stopped. We got the 57 home, black one. Anyways, so what we got going on, uh, Challenger's gone, 56 is gone, um, and we got this race we're going, well, I'm going on. Um, today is June 30th, right? 29th? No, yeah, 30th. Tomorrow, tomorrow I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this up tomorrow, so when you're watching this, it'll be July 1st, Canada Day for us, but we're not celebrating from Matt at Canada and all their rules. But, uh, I'm headed out to Saskatoon to help my buddy Josh work on his 55 Chevy, which we're going in this Miles of Mayhem race, which is kind of like a uh, Canadian version of Drag Week, Rocky Mountain Race Week, something like that. So it starts on Monday. Today is Wednesday. I'm and the car is? I'm driving Thursday. So I'm going to get there Thursday afternoon. The car is apart. Couldn't be more apart. There's no drive line in it. He, he had a running driving car. He put a straight axle under, which was a fiasco. We're, we're mad at Speedway over it. He's got a four nine inch in it, which he couldn't get brakes. So I had to buy brake drums for him. I've got all sorts of like water necks. I got starter. I got extra radiator in case you need it. I had to get a drive shaft. He couldn't get a drive shaft made. So Ryan, Domar transmission, love that guy. Like immediate overnight, like four inch heavy duty drive shaft with like everything you need. like. What a nightmare. I'm, into, I'm like a partner in this car. Um, I bought that fiberglass hood for him. So he's got to pay back for that. And uh, we got to put that on. He's got glass fenders, glass doors. Oh, it's going to be something. Anyways, so I'm going to try to do, we're going to get out. Well, I'm going to get out there tomorrow. Hopefully it's hot like crazy. I mean, you guys all know the West Coast uh, heat waves everyone's having. Stuff's just melting. So we're going to go sit in a 55 Chevy. Well, we're going to work in his shop with no air conditioning for like three or four days, all hours of day and night get the car running then we're gonna go and drive this thing 1700 kilometers out of this 1200 miles or something like that five days cars been apart never been on the road so what could possibly go wrong so I'm gonna do a bunch of filming on that I'm hoping to put a video up I'd like to do it every day if I can every other day maybe they'll probably be pretty simple because I'll be filming on the road no to hotel it's gonna be you grumpy I'll be grumpy because I, I feel like the next 10 days of my life are gonna be tough I feel like it's gonna be you know like when it's um those like single camera artistic films where it's just a guy in a room and he's like i don't know what i've done with my life anyways it's gonna be a good story <laughs> i don't think it's gonna be a good time i think it's gonna be a good story i'm gonna hang with a bunch of buddies which i'm really excited to do so that'll be good um so that's what the next few days are i do have a couple of videos i think kind of in the bag which i gotta edit still on this pile of junk wagon look at the chaos it's running and driving. I did a column and a heater and a few little things like that. My buddy Mike came by and dropped off this uh, 57 uh, Chevy, which we'll do a proper video on it. Uh, what was it? Strap? Oh, no. We'll do a proper video on this when I get back. Um, as you guys all know, I ripped a pile of stuff out of that white two door sedan. And you were not shy to tell me how dumb I was to do that, sell it as a project. But whatever money's in your pocket money's in my pocket and ultimately i want all those parts for this thing so I, I didn't mind it at all i got paid well for it and i did i did just fine on it so i'm happy so the next project will be this we're going to be well the wagon needs a little bit more love this is going to be a two-door black widow obviously so that's coming up nice uh i've got doors i've got rockers i've got lower fender extensions uh i've got all sorts of stuff so after a quick horrible 10-day vacation where i hate my life I'll come right back, so I'll be back on the 9th or 10th, I guess, of July. Then I get the press because it's my birthday. And then uh, we're right back into more tri pipe stuff. So anyways, I just want to give a quick update. We're going to switch gears real hard here. We're not going to be at home uh, for the next bunch of videos. I don't know how it's going to affect lives, if we're going to do anything. And uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm really excited. I think it'll be a good time. Maybe I'll do my own live. You should. Go for it. Hopefully you guys are into that. Uh, I mean, I know a lot of people want me to do racing stuff. I'm not doing any of the racing. I'm not really, I'm not into race cars, but I'm uh, the passenger seat. I'm probably doing a lot of driving. You're into idiotic yeah, ideas. idiotic ideas. Kind of living my own little Canadian uh, two-lane blacktop dream with a loser buddy of mine. So we're gonna drive from uh, 
Saskatoon and we're going up to like Red Deer and Rimby and all sorts of stuff and we do a big loop and then we end back in Rimby twice I think which is I don't even know how many hours away that is it's, a, it's gonna be a lot of driving just like there and back for me is like 15 hours I think I'll be in the truck just to get to the place and then all screwing around and uh, we haven't booked any hotels because we don't think we're gonna use any because <laughs> we'll probably just be fixing stuff on the side of the road so if that's something you're interested in well you better watch it I guess there's nothing else I can do so what I'm gonna do so that's what's gonna go up for the next week hopefully you enjoy it I'm bringing uh, stuff I got if you have any oh if you have any advice this is gonna go I'm already gonna be on the road by the time this is up tomorrow if you have any advice about drag week or something like that let me know because I have a few days I can buy some stuff or do whatever I gotta do I'm going with a truck full of parts and a water-cooled visa and uh, actually I'm gonna go look at a car on the way so that'll be a good one anyways that's what's happening thanks for watching or whatever and I'll uh, see you guys on the road